Hi, I'm Catherine and welcome back to the CASFIT YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be going through AutoCAD tool sets. So one of the advantages of working with Autodesk and AutoCAD as a product is they've been around a long time. So with that brings a lot of development and we get these robust tool sets built into the software that you might not get with other products. So I'm going to take a bit of a deeper dive into those now for you. So over the years, Autodesk have been able to look at what people are using within the software and identified the most common features and functionalities, strip them back and put them into tool sets, which is exactly what I'm going to go through now. So there are seven different tool sets from Autodesk for AutoCAD, but the main three that we talk about are the architecture tool set, the mechanical tool set, and the electrical tool set. So I mentioned the three main tool sets that we commonly use, which is the architecture, the mechanical, and the electrical. But I just wanted to show you some quick statistics on the electrical one that I think will blow you away. The electrical tool set on its own is the only thing like it within the Autodesk suite. So it boasts the largest productivity gain at 95% which may be related to the menu, which includes over 2,000 schematic symbols. Not just that, but it automatically connects associated wiring and components as they're created via a numbering and parent-child system without the need to handle all of it manually. So one of the most commonly asked questions we get here at CADSPEC in our technical team is, how do I install them? So I'm gonna show you now how to install them. Okay, so I've logged into my Autodesk account and I'm now looking for AutoCAD Mechanical. Okay, there it is. So if I've got good, strong internet, I will simply click the install button, accept the terms, and then it will start downloading. Now, the other option you have is click view details, find the year we want, um, which is the 2024 download and then we're gonna click the little button there and click download. I'm now going to open it by double clicking and then this will load up the actual installer itself. Um, so it will take just a few minutes for that to download. Okay, we'll wait for that to load. Okay, so you'll then be presented with this window where it offers opening folder or run installer. So this might be when you can grab yourself a coffee and just wait a few minutes for this to open up ready because this could take a few minutes. Right, okay, so with this pop-up, you can decide where you want this download or install to go. So if you've got enough space in your C drive, you can install it there. Otherwise, just direct the install to the desired folder you want. Then we click install, and I'll probably speed this up for video purposes. Okay, it's just finalizing by the look of it. And then we hit start, and the install is complete. Now I'll just head down to the bottom bar and I'll open up my AutoCAD Mechanical. So as you can see, it looks very similar to normal AutoCAD that you might be used to. There is just a few slight differences with the buttons at the top. Now I won't go into it in this video. It might be one we do in the future. So hopefully that install video helped you out. If you are still stuck, please get in touch with us. Tool sets are so powerful within Autodesk and we highly recommend you using them. If you're on your AutoCAD journey or still unsure on how to use a software or install it, we have a lot of other videos in our YouTube channel. Got any questions? Ask in the box below. But for now, see you next time.